Bay Area bird's eye view of the bay from the top of an icon. Today in the Bay's Barbara Dell, the only TV reporter allowed up on the South Tower today of the Golden Gate Bridge ahead of the bridge's 75th anniversary celebration. You're all bundled up. Is it cold? Uh, it's very cold, windy, wet. As we've been getting bursts of uh, wind in here. And of course, you've got the fog. If you were to look down right there, right now we're looking south. If it wasn't fogged in, you'd be able to see the deck with the traffic, the southbound commute, about 500 feet below, of course. The right now I'm sitting on the rooftop of our work, reporting live from Notre Dame. And reporting live tonight, New Perry High School. Live in Niles. Reporting live in South Bend. Live from Silver Beach in St. Joseph, Michigan. Reporting live on a plane over Elkhart. Reporting live tonight in an RV. You're live in Elkhart. Live from South Bend. Reporting live in Cass County. You're watching Friday Night Football on ABC 57. Woo! Message to the fans as he comes through. And now the heat parade has come close to the American Airlines Arena. It is approaching on Biscayne Boulevard, the Freedom Tower, and the arena where it all happened. And you get that live look at LeBron James waving his arms up in the air as a champion. Boy, that must feel good. Boy, you got to love that picture. That's an HD picture. We're the only ones with a camera that close in HD to King James, LeBron James. And already, they're making their way here through Biscayne Boulevard to the American Airlines Arena. Finally, Bob is doing it. He's listening. Bob, you're on ice. Good morning, my man. I am, and I haven't uh, broken anything yet. We're here at the HP so Pavilion. Good morning to you, uh, John and Laura. This is going to be the site of the 2012 U.S. Figure Skating Championship. Tickets go on sale today. That's why we're out here. Championships are still not until late January. we got a past champion here and a future competitor but talking about Rachel Flatt. Hey, good morning to you. Good morning. How are you? Esto queremos celebrar esta víspera del Día de Canarias por todo lo alto. Y cuando decimos por todo lo alto es literalmente. José, ¿qué vas a hacer? Hablando, José, que no te oía. Bueno, <risa> eh, por todo lo alto, nunca mejor dicho. Estamos a 2.200 metros en el, de, en el despegue de Isaña. Fíjate qué vista, qué mar de nubes tenemos. Vamos a despegar en parapente y vamos a aterrizar. <risa> perfecto, perfecto. Perfecto, corremos. Lo estamos contando en directo. ¡Ole! No me siento todavía. Me siento, sí, señor. Our chief political correspondent is there, of course, Carl Cameron, live on the road in what? Sarasota, Florida? Is that where you are? Is that what's near you there, Carl? Well, let's show you, actually. We're just about to start crossing over a little bit of the bay here, leaving Tampa on the way to Sarasota. Herr Seidel, Sie beobachten den Transfermarkt ja auch sehr genau. Also für wie viel haben denn die Clubs eingekauft? Also wie hoch waren bislang die gesamten Transferausgaben der ersten und auch der zweiten Bundesliga? Ist Wolfsburg an Nummer 1 mit sieben Transfers über 21,5 Millionen ausgegeben. Und der Top-Transfer als solches, der ist schon ein bisschen länger her, war ja Bernd Leno, der ja als Torwart von VfB Stuttgart... You are about to witness a first for everyone here at NBC2. You gotta see this. New technology means new experience experiences for our viewers. Right now we have a crew live inside of a classic World War II aircraft and that's not all. That plane is flying above Lee County right now. It's part of the Wings and Freedom Tour at Page Field and Stephanie Kolp is up there. I know it's loud, Steph. Can you hear me? I got to tell you, uh, I've done a lot of things for this job, but this is certainly uh, one of the coolest. I guess I should sign out live over the Caloosahatchee River, Stephanie Kolp, NBC2. Für den ganz großen Event heute. Ja, wir sind verbunden mit Herr Strempel in Cannes. Alles bereit für das große Schaulaufen der Stars? Naja, fast bereit. Und ich muss sagen, ich bin jedes Jahr wieder fasziniert, wie die es in Cannes schaffen, wirklich bis zur letzten Minute zu schrauben, zu hämmern, zu sägen. Die Stadt ist heute Morgen teilweise noch ein ziemliches Chaos. Uh, this is fun. Uh, I think this is kind of like the last day before we get into our full game prep. So, uh, you know, it's something that we have to do, so you might as well enjoy it. You know, the fans are new to media day. This wasn't like that last time, which I think is cool, man. I think anytime you can get the fans involved with anything, it's just a, it's just a great addition. And uh, we're having a blast, man. This team has become really close, and we're just having a good time together. Wow, 
what a, what a night. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, guys. Hey, you all right? We're just uh, leaving the track after a hard day's work of testing and what have you, and uh, we'll be going to be with you shortly. can give you the best view of the foggy conditions out there on the roadways this morning. That's because new technology puts you right behind the wheel. Literally. 13 News photojournalist Jason Walsh shows you what we mean. He's on the road. Good morning, Jay. Good morning, guys. I'm out here on 264 West just outside downtown Norfolk. And you can see this pretty heavy area of fog out here. Between the downtown area and the 64-264 interchange, the visibility has been pretty bad pretty much for the entire morning. Keith, can you hear me? Right, I've lost contact with the Oh no, he can't hear me. On, but I'll see you. Go ahead and turn around here. That is up to so Street, guys. cool. And people taking pictures. There are little old ladies passing them. Go ahead and turn around, Terry. You got people taking pictures of this. <laughs> of course. Can't wait to see how well this turned out. We had it up to about 60 or 70 miles an hour. Don't tell the police. I told Jerry we had uh, <laughs> that we had clearance from police to do this. It's a street legal car, I did find out. Yeah, uh, but is it legal that you're going that fast? On the, the, the roadways through, uh, you know, promotional promotional events like they've got right now. I, I want to get Hi a there. shot of him walking out to see this <laughs> legal.